Under criminal law, a principal is the main participant in the commission of a crime, whereas a bystander is typically someone who merely witnesses the crime. Courts typically don't impose a legal duty to interfere on bystanders. But the court in State v. Davis considered whether a bystander may be found guilty as a principal if his inaction facilitated the crime. Dewey and Gerald Davis were a father and son who lived in a mobile home in West Virginia. In 1986, a girl who was a close family friend went to the Davis's home to pick up laundry. Gerald asked her to go with him to his bedroom, and when she refused, he tried forcing her into his room. The girl ran to the living room and begged Dewey for help, but Dewey, who had been drinking, refused to help her. Dewey stepped aside, and Gerald grabbed the girl and dragged her into his room. Dewey followed them into the room and lay next to the girl on the bed while Gerald sexually assaulted her. The girl again begged Dewey for help, but he just patted her hand and told her not to worry. West Virginia charged Gerald and Dewey with sexual assault. A jury convicted Gerald as a principal in the first degree and convicted Dewey as a principal in the second degree. Dewey appealed to the West Virginia Supreme Court of Appeals, asserting that as a mere bystander, he lacked the involvement necessary for the trial court to convict him as a principal in the sexual assault. 